Hey, thanks for joining us. I have Shelly, and she is a patient having a procedure done on her ear. Shelly, say hi to everybody. Hello. So what's going on with your ear? I have had some issues with my ear for like a month. Um, I wasn't, I've had some hearing loss, and it turns out I have fluid in my ear. That's and causing me not to be able to hear to my full extent. So what's happening? So they are going to drain my ear and then um, put a tube in. Okay, are you nervous? A little, yeah. Okay, does it help to have me here? Yes, will you <laughs> okay. hold my hand? I'll hold your hand, make sure you're okay. <laughs> you're doing great. Now, we had already filmed uh, Dr. Fife putting in a little bit of anesthetic, so can you tell anything different from the anesthetic going in? Uh, when it was going in, it was like a cold, like tingly feeling, but now there's nothing. It's just normal. Okay. And no change in hearing. Mm -mm. It's been sitting there for 10 minutes. We'll come back in and we suction it all up. It'll be really loud. And that's honestly one of the things that bug people the most is the sound. Okay. Once that's been sucked up, small little incision in the eardrum, and we're talking about a, a hole about that big, um, you'll feel a loud pop, a little bit of pressure, but it shouldn't be much painful after that. Okay. And then once that's opened up, we suction all the fluid out. Again, it's going to sound like a hurricane going off in your ear. Um, you should notice an immediate improvement in your hearing once that fluid's out. And then we'll put this little tube in. Um, the little tube shouldn't hurt much going in. Uh, a little bit of pressure, you'll hear kind of a loud rumbling business with it. Um, and then once that's in, it's done. Okay. okay. So the whole actual procedure, seven, ten minutes, something like that. Okay. Not a big deal. Okay, can I have a little uh, cerumen curette? You want the whole little ridge inside? <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Dr. O has these funny ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's that. Now go ahead and hand me the um, lidocaine. Okay, so it's on a big needle, but that, not to inject, it's just to get it close to your eardrum. All right, that's it. So we're going to let that sit in there for about 10 minutes. Okay, okay not a big deal. I can leave you sitting back or we can sit you back up, whatever. I'll sit up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's more what I would do too. All right. So it is uh, 1225. So 10 minutes, we'll come back and do the rest. And then oh, I'll throw that away. And then we'll go. It's honestly not much worse than that. You're going to okay. not a big deal. Okay. Thanks. We're good? Yep. Okay. All right. And then a little suction. What size? Uh, like a five. Yeah, looks great. So loud noise again, that's just the suctioning. It's removing that uh, numbing medicine off of the eardrum. And then we'll, we should make sure to record this here too. It's capturing, right? Record. Here's the suction back. Myringotomy knife, please. All right, so here's that part I was talking about, a little bit of pressure, pop. Okay. okay. Thank you. Very thick eardrum. Okay, suction again, please. Okay. 
That's all the fluid coming out of your ear. Does that sound any different as it is? A little, there's a lot of stuff. Yeah, like. yeah, absolutely. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video of Shelly's Meringotomy and Tube Placement. In the next part, you'll see Dr. Fife attempt placement of the tympanostomy tube and a surprising reaction by Shelly's nervous system. When that video comes out, you'll be able to find it on the Auburn Medical Group YouTube channel. And if you're subscribed, you'll automatically get notification from it. Just be sure to hit that little bell icon. Until next time, Dr. Mark Vaughn telling all of you to stay in good health.